Okay, and I'm ready to go to work. How did I ready? I think I'd go to work like this. Oh, it actually works. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome back to Miso Dog TV channel. And today we will have things you can buy at the 100 yen store. So today we picked up six different unique and rather odd things that you can pick up at Japan's 100 yen store. So first we have, looks like a scissor sharpener. Okay, next we have, what is this? Oh, you can open up pet bottles, cans, and pull tabs. Okay, next is, what is this? According to this tag, it's a towel holder. And you clip it to your belt or your pants. And another thing to clip. There's a lot of clips today. And this one is for pet bottles. Oh, this one I could see myself using. And a lemon spray. <laughs> Don't know when you'd actually be using whole lemon to just spray. And then last but not least is something. First, I thought this was like a shoehorn, so you can put your shoes on, but apparently it's for squeezing toothpaste and getting the last bit of it out of the tooth. So today we're just gonna try each of them and see how they actually work. Okay, so let's get started. First we have our scissor sharpener. For those who don't understand Japanese, unfortunately, the instructions are, well, in Japanese. But it's easy enough to use, so let's try it out. It looks a lot cheaper. Oops, oops, it's a little bit flimsy, you can see. Oh god, I don't even know if this is worth 100 yen or not. Okay, so first, I think we have a scissors and paper. Let's try to cut this paper and see how it works. So, cuts fairly well. <laughs> Unfortunately, I guess we don't have any dull scissors. It cuts just fine, but let's try with this and see if it cuts it even better. So, according to this picture, you just Move it back and forth. It's like dulling it. So normally the scissor sharpeners that you see in you know, actual stores, not 100 yen stores, they're, the middle part is more metal. And you know, it actually helps to sharpen it. But this one is just plastic. It's like not... Okay. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if it made it even harder to cut. I don't know if it's just me, but it actually feels like it cuts it even, it cuts it a bit better or smoother. I mean, I think you actually need dull scissors to turn out, but it's okay, I guess. Not sure how well it works, but at least the scissors still cuts. Sure, I mean, if your scissors is really bad and you really want to try it and you only have 100 yen to, to buy a scissor sharpener, then sure, purchase it try it out, but otherwise you could spend the 100 yen on something a lot better than this. So next we have, what do we have next? We have the odd looking opener. I guess you can do multiple things. So according to this, you can open a can, you can open a pet bottle, and you can open the little pool tabs. Oh, and one interesting thing. So when I saw the packaging, I was wondering why? Why do they have like little ducks here? What does that have to do with anything? If you look at the shape, it actually looks like one. So to use the pet bottle, you just put the cap in and twist. So, so the small one doesn't fit, so we have to use a big one. Ha, oops, I had it going backwards. Hey, it works! For people who can still open a bottle normally, I'd suggest just opening it normally. But if you're like my parents or, you know, grandparents and hey, it'd make a nice gift, I guess. Let's try another function. This is also one of them. Okay, so this is just ponzu sauce. Oh, okay. So it has a normal cap, but if you look on the inside, there's another pull tab. So according to our handy dining instructions, to use a pull tab, we just use this small one and pull it up. So, okay. Oh wow! So, with the tab, you just pull it and 
<laughs> and it works. Oh, <laughs> this is actually pretty useful. For me, I have, to have a trouble pulling this because you know, you pull it too soft, it won't do anything. If you pull it too hard, you'll just end up spilling it all over yourself. So this actually makes it a lot easier to just pull. We have our last test, a can. For the sake of this experiment, let's try to use this. So this time, instead of using a small one, we'll use the big one with a little, if you can see, it has a small little tooth there to pull it. Just put it in there and <laughs> this made it a lot easier to pull the tap, but at the same time, you have to think. You're going to the convenience store, you buy a drink, and are you gonna always have this on you when you go when you go to the convenience store, go to a store? No. You know, unless you cut your fingernails really, really short or you just have no strength at all to pull the tab. Sure it's useful, but at the same time, well, really do you really need this? For me, I don't think I'd buy it. It's, I mean, I could do pretty much everything with my fingers. I have 10 of them at least, and, but I mean, it's useful, a lot more useful than, you know, say, a scissor, shirt, scissor shirt, right? But if I had to give this a rating out of 10, I'd give it a nice good seven. It's handy to have around the house, and for 100 yen, I'd pick it up. So let's put that on the side, and let's start the next one. So next we have actually two of our products. First we have our towel holder and next we have our pet bottle holder. So both of these are clips. First I'll try the, the uh, towel holder. Okay, and we have our towel. Not a very good towel, but just fold it like this and put it through and ta-da! You have your towel holder. This isn't something that you probably want to wear outside of, you know, when you're just going to work or something, because then you just get a lot of looks. But otherwise, I mean, it looks like it fulfills its purpose. So next, let's try the pet bottle holder. So we have the pet bottle from before, and all we need to do is push it in and pop. So let's try it out. One here. Not the coolest thing in the world, but I mean, it looks like it does its purpose. Okay, and I'm ready to go to work. Have not ready. I think I do with this. You can always use this too. And you have your handy dandy pet bottle opener and can opener. And it's like, oh, I bought a pet bottle. Oh no, I can't open it. It's too weak. I'm too weak. You just uh, unclip this, put this on, and open. And boom, you're good to go. In terms of usefulness, the towel would be good for if you're going out and then, you know, if you're going out hiking, construction, or anything, you might actually buy this. For 100 yen, this is a good purchase. Okay, so next we'll have something else. Okay, next we have the rather more interesting thing that I was looking forward to. The lemon squirter, the lemon spray. Okay, so... In that can apparently come off. Over here we have two nice lemons and we're only going to use one for today. Okay. So unfortunately we don't have a knife. We have our awesome scissors that we use the sharpener with. So let's see if the sharpener actually worked. So this is the ultimate test. Oh, okay, here we go. Oops. So according to this, you just push it in here. Oh wow, it actually does go in pretty easily. Oh, <laughs> and this actually might work. Be aware, if you, when you do turn it, the lemon just kind of spills out. So, I mean, half the job is already done. Oh, it actually works. It actually sprays. Oh, it actually, I'm not sure if you can see this. It's amazing. It's glorious, it actually sprays. Holy crap, I did not expect this to actually work. <laughs> Lemon does actually come on and I sprayed the entire table already. So the ring. Ta-da! Ah, I wish I had a towel or something too. Oh, oh, what do I have here? I have a towel. Oh, how useful. Wipe the table and... It's nice and clean and lemony. And after such a hard day's work, you know, 
Just wish I had something to drink and... Oh, lo and behold, I have this lovely clip here so I can take a nice drink. Ah, you might not be the coolest kid in town, but you'll be the one with the most useful gadgets with you. This is actually really useful, but I mean kind of a waste. And you're using an entire lemon just to spray, and I'm not sure when you'd actually use the entire lemon to spray something unless you have a gigantic salad. I think I might actually buy this for, for my house. With that done, our table's nice and clean. Let's go to the next and our last final pack. Okay, now we're on to our last and final product, and it's, I don't know what you call this, tube, tube destroyer, tube, tube thing. It just takes out the left, leftover of your tube, or curry, or stew, it comes in the packages. You can use this to just, you know, take out the leftovers, so you don't have any more remaining in the package and wasting it. If you eat rice, you can use it as a rice scooper, but that's not what it's made for. It's made for something like this. And there's a slot in between, and then you just, just, okay, <laughs> and maybe there's nothing left in here. Okay, this is not looking very good for 100 yen. <laughs> or maybe there's just no more toothpaste left over in here. Well, you get the idea. <laughs> so this is the normal way that I try to take out the last remaining bit of the toothpaste. You just fold it up. Oh wow, there really is no more toothpaste. Oh no, no. So I mean the good old fashioned just roll it and just squeeze it out is probably for it's probably makes it a lot easier. And now that I have um some toothpaste here on the table, I'm sure you all know where this is heading. Get my handy dandy lemon here. Towel. And wait, it's Lemon a good cleaner towel. We just put it back on our clip here and we're good. Okay, so I wouldn't purchase this really for 100 yen. I'd rather buy something else. Out of 10, I'd give maybe like a two or a three. This though, I use. Okay, so now we have our final wrap up. We have scissors, scissor sharpener. So for this, like I said, it just looks like a little cheap piece of plastic. I wouldn't buy this really. It's probably worth to me a rating out of 10 of zero perhaps. And then next we have our lovely handy dandy pet bottle can opener and pull tab opener. This one I might actually purchase you know, for 100 yen, why not? This uh, towel holder, towel keychain thing, you can see a little bit of toothpaste stuff on it. This one, mm, personally, I don't think I'd buy it. But for, for a gift, for someone who is outdoors or, you know, is in construction, this might be useful. This one, you know, it's useful, it's great, but at the same time, it looks pretty dorky. I actually would, wouldn't mind carrying this. I mean, this you can put in your bag, you know, in your bag. Now this, the biggest surprise of today, the lemon, because it actually shoots stuff. For 100 yen, I'd buy this. And then last but not least, this two squirted thing, which unfortunately we weren't able to really make use of today. I'd rather just roll it up and squeeze it on that one. So this is our lineup today. I declare today's winner a toss up between these two. If you like this video, you know, please click the like button below, hit subscribe. We're always trying to improve our videos. So I'll catch you later on the next video. Goodbye.